uh, what I'm hearing you say is that there's benefit to moving mm -hmm. for one thing. Um, there can be benefits absolutely to moving in a group format. Mm. There can be benefits to exploring on your own, all of, you know, your body and, and, and diving into a more solo exercise experience. Mm -hmm. It's like knowing that you have all of these options and knowing um, when to use them, when's right for you. Cause maybe there are certain periods of your life that you go through where you do want a more solo exercise experience, but then, mm -hmm. you know, there are other times where we cherish being in a group, cherish working out outside versus in a gym. Mm -hmm. And there's like reasons why all of those might be beneficial. Yep. Bingo. So spoiler alert, context matters. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I have a question though. I yeah. was, like I wanted to the idea of um like the class and like soul cycle mm -hmm. and uh, maybe even CrossFit to a certain extent, the idea of um these more like church, like mm -hmm. using exercise. And I mean I hear people say that anyway, even if they just go and they work with a personal trainer or they go and they just are regular at the gym, like that there's this this is my church, this is my mm -hmm. I mean, when you said like shamanic experience sort of at the class and like the like catharsis or whatever, like screaming mm -hmm. and like shouting and, um, or the idea of like, even at soul cycle, like turning the lights down and having the candles and like these very, almost like trying to elevate it to a spiritual experience for people. Mm -hmm. I just, when you were in the class, did mm -hmm. you, mm -hmm. I don't know. No. <laughs> um, did the... you get that? Did you, or have you? What do you no. think about people using exercise in that way? Or I, you know, I, I can really, yeah. yeah, I've looked at the chemical reasons for that. Like I'm very, like my intellectual interests are in like the chemicals of exercise. Okay. And there's definitely like real things 